Hello, this is Himanshu and in today's video, I'll be demonstrating you how you can go about setting up your coding environment. This is specific for computer programming. This video is specifically for Ubuntu as I personally like Ubuntu when it comes to coding. You can also install it for free if you want to try it. It is free and fast. So after installing Ubuntu, you can launch your terminal by pressing Ctrl, Alt and T on your keyboard. The first thing we need to write our code is an editor. Fortunately, Ubuntu comes installed with a very good editor called gedit. To launch gedit, you can write gedit space file name on your keyboard. Okay, first let me create a new directory where I'll be keeping my codes change directory so gedit space file name hello.cpp is our file name you can split the screen by pressing windows and arrow keys on your keyboard as you can see i split my screen in half let's start writing our code I'll go ahead and print hello world so to compile it I'll go and open a new terminal so new terminal I'll write G++ space file name we created okay first we need to change the directory g++ space file name so it is compiled now we can run our file a.out this a.out com contains the executable file and we can run it by pressing dot forward slash a dot out now what is g plus plus g plus plus is a compiler which is used to compile our C++ codes to check if it is pre-installed in your Ubuntu you can check by G++ space version now as you can see it is already pre-installed in my machine if it is not installed you can do so by running the compile uh, running the command sudo apt-get install g++ it asks for your password okay, so it is already installed now as you have noticed I got this template this code snippet by pressing main and tab so where it come came from it came from here press this settings button and go to manage snippets in manage snippets as you can see C++ has many predefined snippets you can change them by clicking one of them and adding a change as you can see I placed a comment this is the tab trigger if you press main and then tab in any C++ file this snippet will be pasted this dollar zero is the place where your cursor will 
be present after the code is copied so okay I'm gonna close that and demonstrate it once again main tab so as you can see my snippet is already copied so that's all for today i'll see you in the next video where i'll be solving a real-time challenge till then goodbye